Hey guys, how are you doing today? You probably preparing for the upcoming season and that's why I want to talk about the gear and how to set it up. This is my tiny little bar. It's 14 inch long. I cut it by myself. It came 17 inch from Slingshot Standard and I cut it because for multiple reasons. First of all, so my kite is slower and because I very often use seven and nine meter kite, it's really good to have less kite movement because if you have a longer bar, your kite moves faster. Second of all, it's a visual thing. So it looks nice and cute when I'm holding it because when I'm using like 20 inch bar, it looks like double size of me. So these are two reasons I cut it. And, and I feel it, I like it this way, I can use this length with all, all kites with 7 or even 13 it doesn't bother me that my 13 is slower second thing are my lines they're standard 20 meter and i like it that way because it gives my kite more slack and it makes it feel better for me 20 meter lines are pretty sweet because you can do handle passes easier tricks easier so it makes your life easier <laughs> But that's my opinion and that's my setup. I know the other riders set up differently and that's why I ask a few of my friends how they set up their gear and just check it out. Hey guys, this is Yuri Zone. Uh, my line setup is a 17 inch bar, just a stock bar from Slingshot. I got a deep power above the bar and then I'm riding 20 meter lines. Um, for once, uh, I've been riding it for pretty much all my life, all my professional career. And on the other side, I really like um, I really have the feeling that it gives a more explosive feel to the kite instead of a long floaty drag of the kite with longer lines um, so yeah the 20 meters they, they, they perfectly fit my riding style it has a quick quick response to the kite as well and um, you know that's that's what I'm really looking for in the kite uh, the 17 inch bar it really fits well to to my whole quiver so basically from a 7 meter all the way up to a 14 meter uh, I can use that bar and they don't have to change between smaller or bigger bars because um, I like to have my setup uh, almost exactly the same throughout all the sizes. So uh, yeah, that's what it is for me. Hey, I'm Sam Light. I use 20 meter lines for kite loops and big air on small kites. I use 23 meter lines for freestyle, um, it's a bit more forgiving, has more range and I use 27 meter lines for light wind to get the most out of the kite. I use a 15 inch bar for freestyle, I use a 17 inch bar for big air, and I use a 20 inch bar for light wind. Peace! Hi, my name is Marvin, I'm a kite racer, and I will be talking about um, our control bars. We use different bar setups for racing. Um, I have a carbon bar here that's pretty much a homemade job. It's very light, weighs only 300 grams with the lines. Um, we got some short lines on there they're 15 meters also they are only 250 kg load so they're low drag a lot thinner and lighter um, and also you can see the setup is a bit different i'll show you on this bar here um, we use a shackle instead of the chicken loop which just brings the bar closer to you when you're racing so we have a little bit more bar throw than you have on your normal bars in, in freestyle and, and free ride um, so we have this extension on the bar so we can drop more power on the bar um, Also our um, deep power throw is a lot longer Again, so we can depower the kites more because we're riding really powered with big kites and short lines the Reason for the short lines is basically to get better angles upwind and downwind and also be a lot faster In the transitions that we do cool. I hope that helps and yeah, hit me up if you got any more questions